Yo, what's up? Scammer of Alts here, bringing you guys my last video of the year. And as usual, as tradition, it is going to be the top 10 scammers destroyed of 2022. Now, before this video starts, I'd just like to say, ever since I've came back eight months ago now, I have had just tremendous support on the videos, on the live streams, on Twitch, and I really have appreciated your guys' support and welcoming me back and welcoming me back by supporting my videos and sharing them, commenting, watching them, liking them, every little thing that you guys have done to support my videos. I just want to say I appreciate it so much, and I hope 2023 is a great year for the channel and a great year for exposing some scammers because in the last eight months, I have done more than I did in 2021, I would say, because when you guys watch this compilation, you'll notice that a lot of these videos is me literally finding the real information of scammers, getting into their phone servers, taking over a phone server and answering victim calls and warning them that it's a scam, all types of stuff like that. Even the top 10 one, what you're gonna see is it's it's crazy so these videos are ordered this year i put them in the order of 10 is i think is my best scam bait that i have done of 2022 and number one not being my worst but just it's in just the order of from what i think is lesser to what i believe is the best but i'm not saying that's my worst scam bait obviously and as you guys watch it you're gonna see that it's a pretty funny scam bait call but i'm kind of doing this one in more of achievement of what i've actually done yes i've got scammers to rage and lock their computers and stuff like that but then as you'll see as we get further and further, it goes more into how I've pissed these scammers off by exposing their real information to them and sharing that online and putting these scammers to actual shame. So all these videos are cut up into a little bit of shorter versions. As you can see, this video is about two hours and 30 minutes long. If I had the full version of these, this video would probably be four to five hours long. So I've cut out some parts of these videos. So if you wanna see the full videos, I will have a whole thing below in the description of one through 10 with the names and the links of the videos. And also in YouTube scrubber, I will have the videos sectioned up into their different parts if you wanna skip to a certain one. But yeah, I just wanna say thank you guys so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. And I hope you guys enjoy this end of the year compilation. Start the internet connection? How do I restart the no, no, no. the internet connection? So you have to restart your computer. I have to restart the computer for the internet connection. Yes. Yes. What just what do restart, you mean? I'm online with you. I'm online with you, just restart your computer, sir. For the internet connection? Just hold on a minute. Okay. Hello. Hello. Can you hear? Me? Yes, uh, sir. Uh, can you please tell me what do you see on your computer right now? Why well, I see my desk page. You see your desk page. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, kindly, uh, kindly, can you please restart your computer? Restart my computer. Yes, because there was having a problem. That was the reason, sir. You can you please restart your computer? Okay. Huh? Fuck, computer restart. Huh? Hello? Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Oh shoot. Oh he he dipped fast. Oh he dipped fast. <laughs> oh, he was like he 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 goes Fuck, restart the computer and freaking dips off. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Did you guys see all the freaking icons? All the all the pictures showing up on his desk page? Oh jeez. Oh man, that was that was great. He he dipped so quick. He d he dipped so quick. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was like, I was going to go for downloading some of his stuff too. But the way he was like, 
restart your computer, restart your computer. I was like, oh no, this guy, I feel like this guy's going to, you know, disconnect really quick or something. So I was like, all right, let's just delete all this shit and upload all this crap, you know? <laughs> oh man, he, he, like, he, he, like, dipped. He dipped. Like, totally. Like, my gosh. Like he, I haven't heard that since, if you guys saw the video, uh, the video where I delete, I get access to the scammer's computer and I, I sys key it. And then after I sys key it, you literally hear him dive under his desk and unplug the computer from the, from the actual power outlet. That's, that's, that one kind of reminded me of that. <laughs> Let me call back. Oh gosh. I'm going to call back and I'll be like, what happened? How much did I delete? I deleted everything. Huh? <laughs> it's just ringing. Let me let me try from another number. Let me. Yeah, I'm gonna tell him I re I restarted my computer. What do you want me to do now? I got. I just it just came back on here. I just logged in on the welcome screen. It's it's ringing again. This is, I'm calling from a, uh, a different phone number. <laughs> Was that stupid Skype account the only one they had? Do not abuse. I am abusing from the key. Still ringing. <laughs> Has that just shut down their little operation here? <laughs> Oh, the, man, the way he dived, that was amazing. That was an epic reaction for sure. Oh. Thanks for getting connected with customer support. This is James Peter. How can I help you? Yeah, hello. I was, I was just told by someone to restart my computer, and then the call got disconnected. You must, yeah, I huh? guess number yeah motherfucker. Yeah, what? Look at your computer, Ben Chode. You motherfucker. Motherfucker, what are you going to do about it? <laughs> that was the same guy. Oh, gosh. That was the same dude. That was the same dude. Let me call back. That was the same dude. <laughs> oh, perfect. Perfect. I'm calling back. I'm calling back. That was the same exact dude. I'm calling back right now. Did I ever get to meet Steve Harvey? No. It's ringing. It was funny, right as he heard my voice, and I'm like, I had to restart my computer. He's like, you motherfucker. <laughs> He's like, you motherfucker. It's it's still ringing. Maybe I should, let me try with a, a, another number I haven't called them from before. James, how can I help you? Yeah, I was speaking to someone and my call got disconnected. Don't call on this number, you motherfucker. Ben showed. How do you like your new computer? Oh my god, I oh love my, my new computer. You love it? You like? Did you see the pictures that I've put for you? What pictures are you talking about? Go look on look on your desk page. I put a bunch of pictures there. Let me see. Wait, let me see okay. the pictures. Yes, look. Take a look at them. Do you see them? Yeah, I see them. <laughs> what you are doing? Open exactly it. Right now. Open it. Open the picture. Do you see the picture? Wait. I'm not seeing this the is picture the pictures. <laughs> well, well, you got to click on it. I, I have I have all your files too. You can you can buy them back from me with some Google Play cards if you oh want. Oh my god. I'll let you. You don't have any files on your computer. Well, that's interesting because yeah. I deleted over thirty thousand of them. But have you looked at the picture though? What picture are you talking about? The picture I put it on your desktop page. Picture of your mama pussy? No, it's the picture of the dog because you're the slum dog scammer. Motherfucker. Motherfucker, huh? You gonna cry about it? Okay. <laughs> Is that why your mama doesn't love you, so you gotta go and scam people? 
you want here you want to get i'll i'll sell you your files back i'll let you connect back and i'll sell you your files back it'll, co it'll cost you 15 google play gift cards huh ben chode ben chode why don't you why don't you speak up you sound so quiet am i on speaker you motherfucker. You just gonna keep saying that over and over again, Ben Cho Chutia? Bakker Cho. Go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. Don't teach your father how to fuck. How about you take your own advice, Ben Cho? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. The, yeah, the advice of your slum dog scammer dad. Don't call this number. Huh? Mother, I'm, I'm going to keep calling Ben Chode. <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> He's like, let me look at the pictures. He, I'm like, you don't know the, you don't know the pictures? This, this is literally, I'm not sure how many uploaded, but you saw his whole desktop was full of these <laughs> before I got disconnected. And I uploaded it to, I think like his downloads or his favorites too. But you, it literally, if you, when you saw his desktop, it was just full. Of, this is what it is. It's either these ones, which I'm sure it uploaded those first. There's this one too. <laughs> um, there's that one. Let me see. I think I think it's just those two. Oh yeah, there's this one. Got to get the OG Doge, you know, the OG. And then uh, there's these files. It says bye bye money, and it's this is the whole file. Like this is the whole file. <laughs> and there, there's a bunch of different ones like this. This one's called Dummy Scammer. <laughs> And it's just dummy scammers over and over again. <laughs> oh, let me let me call back. Let me call back. Let's call this Ben Chode back. Oh. Available to take your call. Please record your message after the tone. <laughs> press star to discard the recording, or press okay, any know digit to happen. end the recording. Hello, I welcome to the hacking system, Ben Chode. Welcome to the hacking system. Welcome to the hacking system. Welcome to the hacking system. Welcome to the hacking system, Ben Jude. I request 15 Google Play gift cards or your files will be given to the chicken. 15 Google Play gift cards, $500 each. Uh, the chicken is hungry, my friend. Uh, Act fast. Press 1 to listen to the recording. Press 2. Well, I had a thing saying that I had been charged. I told you to not log into your bank from Alright, could you please tell me what are the problems you are facing at the moment? Yeah, I had a thanks so and I had been charged. Hello? 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 No way. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, I, th I think they just turned it off. <laughs> Did they? Yeah, they turned it off. <laughs> I just siskied this guy. What the fuck? <laughs> what? I just siskied this guy. This is, oh my, this is my first call of the day. And... He j he accepts he accept basically what happened he accepted the connection, but he closed his any desk connection to me so I was just connected to him, so I'm like oh shoot what do I do here, and it's rare and rare for scammers to use Windows Seven so I'm like let's go for a Siski. <laughs> what? Two days in a row? No way! I just got a Siski yesterday too. What? what? I'm calling back. Yep, it's ringing. Okay, just wait. 
Now a thing okay. says waiting now for try confirmation okay. again. It says waiting. Okay, accept it. You will click on accept. How do I do that? Oh, now I don't see you that. You will click now on I accept. see request elevation. Disconnect. It says PayPal. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Just try to minimize it. Okay. Do I minimize the big one too? Because there are two boxes. Yes, yes. Yes, it's minimize it. Okay. Okay. I've minimized now open it. your Google Chrome. Open your Google Chrome. Okay. I've got that open now. Okay. Okay. On the very top, on the Google, type over there. B. Type B as in boy. On the, the very top, on the, the address bar. Yes. No, on the search. B. Then X as in X-ray. X. Then C as in Charlie. C. Then A as in Apple. A. R as in Romeo. R. E as in Edward. E. Then dot, put a dot. A dot? Yes. Now type U as in umbrella. U as in umbrella. Then S as in Sam. And S is in Sam? Yes. Now push enter. Now hit enter. Okay. Okay. Now do you see it says secured it says secure code. So you need to type the code which I'm going to there provide you right now. <laughs> so type the, the code over there. Center. The code will be Wait, 0, so what am I doing? One. Sorry, you kinda cut out a little to, bit. You need to put the code over there. Zero four one. I'm putting a code? Yes. Where? Where it says secure code. Do you see it says secure code? You need to type the code over there. On Zero secure four code? One. Oh, where it yes. says secured server in the middle? Oh, I see yes, that yes. little you text prompt you want me to type yes. into. Yes, 041. Okay. 79%. I think his internet's kind of bad because it's like going and then pausing. <laughs> Okay, now just look on the very left oh, bottom of the computer. On the very left bottom corner, do you see? It says keep. Where? I see a thing in the on middle the, of the screen here. No, on the very left bottom, on the left, extreme left corner of the computer screen. The left corner? Well, yes, I see a thing in the middle with discard. like a big red box. Are you talking about this box in the corner? I'm talking about the box, yes. Below the box it says keep or discard. Do you see? On the extreme left bottom of oh, the computer. Oh, yeah, it says this type of file can keep. harm your Give computer. Click on keep. Well, Give it's not going to mess keep. up my computer, right? It's telling no, me it no, can no, harm no. it. No, no, we are sending you that pop-up from our end. All right, oh, so okay. Give a click on keep. On Give keep? a click on keep. Yes, keep. Keep, okay. Okay, now do you see? It says connect voice control. You need to give a click and open that file. Where is that at? On the very left. <laughs> Uploaded all the crap to his computer. In the left? On the very, yes, on the very left corner, do you see? It says connect voice control. And there is the arrow pointing up. Um, is that... Well, I see this thing the in the very, middle of the screen here telling me about no, a I'm session. I'm talking about on the very left. I'm talking about the very left bottom corner. Okay, part. wait. Can it, tell me, like, okay, if I'm looking in the middle of the screen, in the very you middle, where look, am I going? You need, to, you need to look on the very left bottom of your computer screen, on the very left bottom corner. And what's this thing called I'm looking for? It, do you see something says connect wise control dot exe? Oh, yeah, I see that. It's a download, open right? Open that. Yes, open that. Okay. Okay, it's open. Okay, now just wait. Oh, now it says it's downloading something. Okay, this is our... I am trying to get... Now give a click on yes. Give a click on yes. Okay. Okay, now just wait. 
Hello? You can put it in. Hey, scammer. Hey, scammer, can you see your screen? Who is this, sir? Are you doing? Are you trying to move your computer? Who is this? What do you mean? What are trying to do? Do what? What are you doing? What are you trying to do? I'm I'm updating. There you go. Hey, can I ask you something? You're a moron. You're a motherfucker. Yeah, I just deleted all your sessions you had with a bunch of innocent people, you scammer. You motherfucker. Yeah, Ben Chode. And I just siskied one of the other computers in your call Google center, Google. Terry Maki <laughs> Oh, that was great. That means all that account now, he, he, so he, he, this, this software I'm connected with now is like freaking spyware, man. I hate when they use this software because it literally, it turns on with your computer. It doesn't tell you nothing. Look, if I close this, you can't even tell it's running in the background. That it's, it's literally like spyware. And I just, I was like, okay, we deleted all his files. There's the pictures of the doges. Let's go check, check this box and disconnect everybody from his account. So now if he wants to try and get access to those people's computers again, he has to go individually and try and call all of them and do that crap, which I just deleted all the files, which is that's where they, they just write down people's information as they're scamming people. So he probably doesn't know who's who. <laughs> oh, that's great. So now he doesn't have access to their computers. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, the same call center. Oh, that's... <laughs> Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing. Crap. I feel like this guy doesn't get what's happening at all. <laughs> we didn't. We, we do not deal with any desk. I'm sorry. Yeah, sir, you okay? do. Why are you lying to me? Like you from a uh, like? Are you a YouTuber? Are you? I'm YouTuber? your father. I just sis keyed a Can computer and I deleted snake? all the files off this other computer and, and disconnected all. Okay. What, Bencho? You motherfucker, bitch ass. You don't have any work. You don't have any work, motherfucker. This is my bitch. work, stupid. Second, are you bad? And, uh, are you a bad, Bencho? Every time with a Hold YouTube. on, I got some for you. You don't have any content to. You fucking <laughs> asshole. You go fuck yourself, Bencho. Why are you so bad, night, okay? <laughs> you fucking bad, Did I get one of your computers? Did I mess up your clients, Bencho? Oh, I, I, I felt like I did, he, he had to have done. I was like, there's no way he doesn't know what I'm saying to him right now, you know? There's no way he doesn't know what I'm saying to him. <laughs> call back again. You guys know, I'll just call these guys back until I'm blocked. <laughs> oh, man. Hello? His password is cancel123 on his video. Hello? Yeah, hello? Hello? Yeah. Hello? Yeah, just give me a moment, okay? Okay. Dang, I was so close. We almost had two for two. <laughs> His password to his Eddie desk is cancel123. <laughs> it came up asking for a password. I was like, what if I try this right now? <laughs> oh, man. Yes, click on the first link, says Ultra Viewer, the free remote desktop. Okay. Now click on download on the green sign. It there should be download. Tap on download. Okay. In the green one? There goes all his files. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is great. This is great. Okay. Let's 
Oh, oh there sir, it goes. Did you click on download? Yeah, it says uh, this type of file can harm your computer. Do you want to keep Ultra Viewer underscore setup anyways? And it says click keep or keep. discard. Click on keep. Okay. Now just click on the Ultra Viewer file which is downloaded at the left bottom or at the right corner at the right top. It, there should be Ultra Viewer in the bottom, EXE. yeah. Just double tap on that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, now I got like a setup click page. On. Yes, click on next, next, and click on install. Once you click on next, two to three times, you will get a where it says install. Where do I click that at? Uh, sir, on the on the box where it says next, click on next. Okay. Oh, this one. Yes, click on next. Okay. On the on the box. Yes! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry if I just screamed. Hello? Hey, scammer! I'm a scammer. Oh, no, did he unplug it? <laughs> Siski, baby! I knew I'd get it for you guys. I knew it. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I was about to type to this person that I'm about to say I'm a scammer. Oh, I'm sorry. I have, I'm gonna have to put a headphone warning there. Oh man, that was that was too good. Oh, 2022 Siski. I I saw him. I I know. Usually I do like the upload files and stuff first, but I saw him. He kept going and looking at the my connection to his computer. He kept clicking on it and looking at it. Oh, it still things connected. <laughs> he kept clicking on it and looking at it, so I was like, "Oh no, he's gonna, he's gonna see uh, that I'm transferring files." So he just deleted everything off of his computer. Oh, and we got a Siski. <laughs> if you guys can't tell, I've been trying to get these forever, <laughs> for a good minute now. And if you guys saw that what I posted where I failed, oh, that was just the most gut wrenching thing ever. Yes. <laughs> If you're watching this in the chat right now, I don't know. Just type syskeed, man. Just type syskeed. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, this is a crazy week. TSU's back up. Sis just got another syskey. Got a crazy video going out literally in 20 minutes. That's almost an hour long. Oh, and I got to call this guy back. It still thinks I'm on the line with him. But he was using, I don't know if I would have been able to get him to pick back up because he was using text now. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Oh, <laughs> let's call back. This number has been active for like a week. Please press zero. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> this is too good. It's rigging. This is. Hmm. Hello? Thank you for calling support. This is Mike. How can I help you? Yeah, can I talk to the Benchode scammer that got syskeyed? He got his computer locked up and all his files deleted. I'm sorry? Come on, Chutia. Where's he at? Let me talk to him. Scammer? Don't make me go and get that chicken. Where's he at? Let me talk to him. <laughs> Hello? Oh, and he hangs up. <laughs> let's call again. Oh, let's call from a different number. Hello? Thank you for calling support. This is Mike, how can I help you? Yeah, I, I was just speaking to somebody else and my phone call got disconnected.
Hello? How can I help you, sir? Yeah, you I got... my name, please? Yeah, my name's Roger. I got this AnyDesk program on the screen. And why? Why so? Well, because I was talking to this other benchode scammer, like you, and uh, basically I locked up his computer and deleted all his files. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you guys always ask for this? Some, some people don't like it. Some people don't like it. But you guys always ask for this, so we're going to call back and we're going to give them the chicken. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was great. Oh, I literally made my day. Please press here to connect to an operator. This is going to be a great post on TSU. Because I just posted the number on TSU, too. Like, literally 20 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for calling support. My name is Max. How can I help you? Hello, Banchode. Scammer <laughs> got his files deleted. Uh, hey, Banchode. Where's the scammer that got his computer siskied? Uh, huh? Jutia, you, you coward. Dare market chut. What do you got to say, you coward? Coward. Banchode. Dare market chut. I don't know that many words. All right, we got Terry Maki, Chu, Chu, Tia. Shut up. You shut up, Bencho. That's why their files got deleted, and they got a Siski on his computer. How can you be that dumb? You're scamming people, and you get scammed yourself? <laughs> oh, man. I was like, I don't know that many words. I know a couple. <laughs> oh, he was going in on me. Call him back again. You, you guys already know this. You guys already know this. We do. We get on these guys. Oh man. Oh. Hello. Bancho. Bancho. Where's the scammer that got his computer siskied? Same to you. Same to you. You didn't siski my computer. I siskied your computer. You bancho. I'll do that for you. I'll do that for you. No problem. Who, who, whose computer are you going to siski? I'll do it for you, alright? Do what? I'll do a siski on your system, alright? Do it right now. Do it right now. Bencho, you coward. Do it, stupid. That's why all your files got deleted. <laughs> I'll do a siski. I'll do a siski on your computer right now. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. Yeah, it will it will take up for a one hour, sir. An hour for the whole thing? Yeah, I will scan your email. What kind of problem in your email? Then uh, email. Uh, then it, it will take for one hour and. Fix Why your does problem. it take so so long? So it scan your email in your server, and they can send me report in what are you facing in your email issue. Then I can solve it. Okay, sir? Yeah, I get that, but uh, I'm just, uh, I was just asking why it takes so long to. Okay, I, I, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's, yeah, I, it's, I don't mean to be like a, you know, asking a bunch of stuff. I was just curious. Just curious. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's a long process, sir. And it will take for us one hour. An hour? That, that's quite a long time. Yeah, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's a long stuff? time. Uh, he's it's like so. Time. He's like, okay. please stay alive, stay alive. He said it so many times. Holy crap, there goes everything. So, you're, what uh, the? where are you, Cursor, sir? 308,000 files. Are yeah, you? San Antonio, Texas. Yeah, so where are you, Cursor? Sa San Antonio, Texas, please? that's where I'm calling from. Yes, San Antonio, sir. But, uh, your cursor, where are you, cursor, sir? Where are you? Oh, San Antonio. It's a city in, in Texas. San... Yeah, Lake in Bend. City in Texas, sir. Yeah. Oh, you want my address? Not you. I want, need your address, sir. Or is, you Please. want my zip code? Uh, what, sir? You want my zip code? I'm sorry, what are you, what are you asking me for? 
I'm I'm asking please uh, uh, click the next. Oh, click, click next. next. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, sir, click. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. I didn't I didn't get what you were saying. My bad. Oh, jeez. Please uh, click the full scan. Please click the full scan, sir. Full. Oh, this one. Go. Go. Yeah. And. Okay. Uh, click the next. Click this the is next, what sir. he's talking about on my other VM that he's connected to. Click, click next. next sir. Okay. Next. Full scan in progress, it says. Three hundred yeah, so thousand. It will take for one hour, and uh, holy it will crap! Solve your problem. Or please and stay will, with me, sir. And this will fix my outlook. Yes, yeah, sir. Uh, it's a fix your problem. But will it fix my outlook? Yeah, it's fix because your I, outlook. Because I use that. I use that for work, you know. So I need. I need that one to be working, you know. Yeah, sir. It will take for one. Uh, it will take for one hour, and it will fix your problem. Oh, that's good. Yeah, because I didn't. I didn't okay, want please. it to be all messed up or something. Please, uh, yes, you know. Please stay. Please stay online. Please stay online with me, sir. Yeah, I am. Okay. Do you? Mm. I'm. Do it what? Oh, sir, in your He's outlook like, scanning. Oh, this is great. I will need your. You'll need my what? Are you there, sir? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. So please, I need your some kind of information that I can fix your problem. Okay, sir. Okay. What information do you need? Hello? The, what does the files infected to mean? Hello? Yeah, sir? Yeah, I said, what, what does the files infected to mean? Sir, in false they will send me a report. Oh, they're going to send a report? Yeah. And they'll explain and everything? They, yeah, they, they will tell me, uh, explain me everything, what kind of problem in your Outlook, in your server, in your anywhere, oh. your email. Okay. They will send me a report. Okay, sir, please stay on. Oh, I see. Thing. Okay, and that's okay. going to be like a detailed report of everything? Yeah, it's a detailed report for me, in front oh. of you. Okay, sir. Okay, I see. Okay, yeah. Let's do the reveal. Um, so how do how do I get that there? Hello? Yes, sir. Can, can you see your desk page? It doesn't let me control his files. Page? What desk page, sir? Can, can you see your desktop page? Yeah, it's a desktop page, sir. Yeah, can you see it? Please stay on with me, sir. Yeah, I'm just saying, can you see your desktop page? I'm, I cannot, I cannot show the desktop page, sir. Oh. What, sir? Huh? I gave him administrative don't access. Do, I'm trying don't to get do up anything, to anything, sir. Don't do anything. Okay. Don't do anything, sir. Please. Okay. I closed his access. Why are you closing, sir? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, what? I didn't close nothing. Why are you clo Why are you closing, sir? I can I send you. Oh, email sorry, sir. I didn't. Yeah, I see it here, the address page again. I'm sorry, I didn't. I didn't know what I was doing there. But 
I just... I cannot connect with you, sir. I can no I can right. not show your screen. Clay, please. These is there an OK button? Please connect with the sir. Oh, okay. He got so. Oh my gosh, bro. The way he was like, sir, 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 please, please. Please connect. Please connect. Please connect. Don't do anything. Don't. Don't click the X. <laughs> if he clicks the X, I'm gonna laugh. If he disconnects himself. Don't do anything, sir. Okay. Is he, is he gonna click it? Is he gonna... Cut it, sir. Huh? Cut. Is he gonna click the X? You want me to close this? Yeah, close this, sir. Okay. No, sir, no, sir, please, please. I'm not sorry, close. what? Not close, uh, sir, oh. not close. Hold on, let me try and find that. He's trying to connect back so bad. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. Why are you closing, sir? I can see Yeah, I'm trying, I I'm trying to open it. Hold on. I, I'm trying to open it. Yeah, I'm trying to open it. Don't do. I just realized his. Don't do anything, sir. I cannot scan your pro. I cannot scan your email it... and your server. And not. I'm not. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to close yeah. it. His his OneDrive isn't signed in. If you look in the bottom right of his screen, uh, by the ENG logo, his OneDrive's not signed in. If I go on here and I hover over it, I have the same one. Not signed in. <laughs> so none of that stuff was backed up. <laughs> or at least not recent versions. Okay, hello? Can you see? But I, I'm not seeing your uh, laptop screen, so I cannot see. Can you minimize this? How do I see? How do I get? Hold on. Please, sir, I can connect, disconnect with you. Okay. Here, I'll tell you the numbers again. Please, it it gave me, it. it gave me new numbers. I think. I I don't give you any number, sir. Please. No, the any desk I numbers. I'm not I'm not sending for any desk number. I cannot anything. They are. A... You cannot what? Please, please uh, tell me again your uh, any desk number, sir. Yeah. Okay, can it's... You, can you tell me again, sir, your index number? Yeah, let me get it here. It's opening. Yeah, sir, please tell me your index number. Yeah, are you ready? I am ready, sir, please tell me. Okay, yeah, the NEDES number is 875-483-6666. Seven, eight, six. Yeah. In no, it's eight, eight seven five. Eight seven five. Four eight three. I will connect. I will connect. So I will connect. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, now I see that thing again. Okay, it says waiting for confirmation. Yeah, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Is it is it back now? Yeah, sir. I just connected to this guy I'm twice. Your server, sir. <laughs> how, so how much longer of the of the is that going to take? Hello? Yeah, sir. Yeah, how much longer is that going to take? Yeah, I will, they are uh, there for uh, 30 minutes, sir. They will send me a report. Please send me one please. Okay. <laughs> I connected with them on my... <laughs>
<laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Is the report come in yet? Hello? 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 Uh. Hello, scammer? Holy cow. Hello? He disconnected it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> running so many scams oh my gosh did you guys see all the accounts he just hung up holy crap <laughs> holy crap did you see all those accounts <laughs> my guy was going ham holy crap what the f <laughs> bro bro he had so much going and i downloaded all that crap oh <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just like, I'm just like, holy crap. <laughs>
What do you mean, why? Just tell me the ID. Tell me you the know ID the ID. No, you have the ID on your side. He just hung up. He just hung up. I was about to tell him the ID, and he hung up. <laughs> this is this is his um, any desk. By default, it puts the name of your computer and your default picture. <laughs> Here's him sitting on like a ledge. <laughs> Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh, what a benchard! What a benchard! <laughs> he hugged up. Oh, look at this guy! Look at this guy! And you can see here, session closed. Session was closed by the remote user. He closed it. He closed it. Let me retry. Client offline. He shut off the computer. He shut off the computer. <laughs> he shut off the computer. Oh, that's great. That's great. He shut it off. Fuck it. Oh, uh, Ben Chud. Let, let, me, let me see what else is here before I call him back. So it looks like he has the ID of someone here from the United States that he's stolen. He's, he's stolen an ID from someone from the United States. He has a picture of it, so he's probably stolen from that person. He has a picture of a check. And how much is this? $700. So he stole $700 from someone on 325.22. He stole $700. Let me see what this is. Ah. Uh. It says that I'm signed up for some sort of a $799. Uh, Norton billing thing. Email email ID. S. S. Press OK. Yes. Oh, please don't say yes. This was from 2021. He's been sc from scamming for over a year. Let's get to the end and see what this guy says. OK, now I have a little box that says log me in connecting. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, he got connected to this guy's computer. He used log me in. You can see he said, now I get a, a box that says log me in connecting. Ah, uh, he probably scammed that guy, and it's all the way back from 2021. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Let me call back. Let's give them a call back. Yo, guys. Future Vaults here. So, basically, I call this guy back, and it's... It's a very weird conversation. He sounds like he's going in between like a mental breakdown and being tired and not caring, but he stays on the phone with me so long that the original time of this video, if I leave it the original length, is about uh, 50 minutes for the full video. So this call alone adds about 20 to 30 minutes onto the actual video. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to chop up the call to a couple of the uh, more important standout-ish parts of the call. And what I'm going to do actually, this whole video, I'm going to put a full unedited version up on my second channel which will be be linked below so if you made it to this part of the video check out my second channel it'll be linked in the description below and also if you made it to this part of the video thank you for watching number one but comment sr army in the comment section below and i'll go through everyone's comments and people who comment that i'll drop you guys a like on your comment comment that below but yeah here we go into this call Can you hear me? Yeah, hello. Why have you hung up on me? Yes. This is Prince? Prince Kahari. Why aren't you speaking? Who is this? What do you mean? This is the guy that you just tried to Ooh. scam. This is Prince this is Kahari, it. right? This is Mr. Roger. This. You don't remember me? This. Huh? This. What? My name is Sam. Your name's Sam? I don't yeah. think that's your name. I think your name is Mr. Mr. Kahari from India. No, I'm from India, but that's not my name. 
Well, where's Prince Kahari then? I was just speaking to him. On his MacBook? On That's not you? On which phone number? Why do you need to know? I mean, surely he's got, there with you. We got on this number. Nobody calls Northwest Delhi. You're not in Northwest Delhi? No. Are you sure? I'm in I, th- I think Calcutta. that's you. You're in Calcutta? Yes. Wasn't well, it Kolkata? Yes. Well, how are you saying it wrong if you live there? What I'm saying wrong. Why why aren't you just admitting it? <clears throat> I'm admitting I'm in Calcutta. You're a scammer. You've been exposed, and now you're just saying that you're Sam. What, are you going to say this is Walmart now? Walmart? Today, I'm Amazon. Oh, today you're Amazon. <laughs> oh, you don't? Yeah. So, if you're supposedly not Prince Kahari, where is he? I was just speaking to him on this number, and I have his ID right here, and his picture. Which number? On this number, your number. What do you think? I'm going to just let him keep talking, and I'll I'll see if someone can translate it later. Anyone know what he just said there? Translation, he can't mess with us from over there. You said I can't mess with you from over here? What if I tell you I'm coming to India? And I'll come to your address. You can come anytime. You said I can come? I'm waiting for you. Yes, you can come anytime. Yeah? Why are you breathing like that? I'm not breathing... Oh, Carl Rock is over there. What if I got in, in? Oh, yeah, I could just, I could, maybe I could message Carl Rock, send him the information. He could make a whole video about talking to you. Would yeah. you like that? We could set up an interview. Yes, yes. You would. Sign so, to, so now you're admitting to, to it. Scam baiter. <laughs> you know what a scam baiter is. Sign it to Perogi. <laughs> so you know what a scam baiter is, but you still managed to get to get reverse scammed. That means you're really stupid, huh? Are you okay? I feel like you're having like a breakdown or something right now. I feel like your mental health is taking a very big hit with this. But I'm sure you didn't care when you stole a bunch of money from other people. Oh, you don't care? Mm -hmm. Well, then can can I ask you why? Why why do you like to, uh, why do you enjoy scamming people and being a piece of crap? Don't waste my time. Don't waste your time. Well, you waste people's time every day with your Mm bullcrap emails and your bullcrap tech support scams, don't you? Yeah. Why are you why are you acting like you you don't care about this at all when you originally hung up the call and turned off your entire computer and now you're acting like you don't care? Are you okay? Um, I am okay. You don't you don't sound okay. This is I don't feel bad for you, but it's just like I don't I don't really get what you're trying to accomplish here. It's you know, I'm kind of a uh, I don't know. What are you trying to do here? Do you want to like go out and have like a? We should we should set up like an interview with you. Yes. Oh, but but wait, you're not you're not Prince Kahari, right? You just like staying on the phone with me. Oh, then. Oh. Oh, he's on another phone call. <laughs> now he hung up. <laughs> That's funny. Let me call him back. I can't I can't understand what he's trying to do here. <laughs> Hello? 
Yeah, I was I was speaking to somebody and my phone call got disconnected. They picked up. Who are you talking to? Who are you speaking with? Do you have a name? Or... Um, Mod. I'm sorry. Yeah, M O H D Mod. I'm not I'm not sure how to pronounce the game, the name. And what is your name, sir? Roger. Mahed Khaled Khan. That's his full name. I didn't get that, sir. I'm sorry. M O H D M O H D. I think it's Mahed Khaled Khan. M O H D K H A L I D, and then K H A N. Oh, he hung up. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, he hung up. Let's let's call back. Let's call back. Yo, guys, future revolts here again. Um, basically, what happened is I kept trying to call these guys over and over again, and when they would pick up, I would tell them the name. You know, you know, do you guys know Muhammad Khalid Khan? And they would basically just hang up or and then block my number. So then I would call back on the same number and it would be blocked. And then I would call back on another number and I'd say, Hey, do you know Muhammad Khalid Khan? The same thing again. And they would either hang up and block my number or just hang up and I'd be able to call again. So I figured, you know, why not? We have his personal number here let's go ahead and call this guy's personal phone number so that's what you're about to see right here i'm calling his personal phone number so this is his cell phone i'm literally calling him on his cell phone so yeah this is pretty crazy i'm trying to see let me try and call his personal number again let me try his personal number again they do hello yeah yeah, are you the person I was speaking to about my computer? Who you're calling? I'm calling you, Mohammed. No, I think. Yeah, why did you hang up on me? Yeah, calling Walmart. Walmart? Why did you steal a bunch of money from a 74 year old man? You're in New Delhi, India? Right. You're in Delhi, New Delhi? Hello? Why aren't you speaking? Oh, he just hung up. He said it was Walmart. <laughs> he said it was Walmart. Oh, that was the guy. That was the guy. Did you guys hear his voice? Did you guys hear his voice? That was the same guy. This is him. This is him. <laughs> Oh, boy. Now we have confirmation that this is 100% him. You guys heard his voice? He's scared. He said, he literally goes, this is Walmart. I couldn't tell if the phone was lagging or if his voice was shaking. Oh, man. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Let me see. I'm trying to see if there's any information here that would let me get um his... uh. Cause I want to get I want to get one of his social medias, yo. Future revolts here again. So as you can see from that clip, we call the scammer on his personal number, and he really doesn't want to talk to us. He actually ends up saying, "Oh, this is Walmart and stuff." So I'm during the stream. I'm like, you know what? Let's try and see and use this information and see if we can actually see what this guy looks like. You know, because we got his personal number, we got his email, all that stuff. Let's see if we can get his personal information and actually fully expose this guy and put him on blast, which is actually what I do here. Later in the video, I do call him back, so stay tuned for that. But right here is the pictures of the scammer. So as, as you can see here, I just want to explain how I got this information really quick. So as you can see here, we have the preview of buyer registration form, which is one of the documents that I got off the scammer's computer. And you can see his email here, MKD Khaled or mdcollid1990 at yahoo.com. And you can see here, he also has a preferred user ID, which is mdcollid1999. And lo and behold, that user ID is actually his Instagram account. But he actually ended up deleting his Instagram shortly after I called him out for stealing people's files and uh, their money and stealing all the information from a 74 year old man who didn't know any better. But this is the guy right here. This is the guy 
who was stealing people's money and stealing a 74 year old man's money and many other people's money bank account photos all that stuff this is the actual guy on his instagram account like i said he actually ended up deleting this maybe an hour after i called him out live on stream if you go to my instagram i have a post of me sharing this right there and actually adding him from my instagram adding his personal instagram account and saying yo why are you scamming people so i actually took all these pictures before he deleted the account but as you can see here this is the actual guy this is the guy who was stealing people's money this is the guy who was telling me that there's a Windows pop-up on my computer and that I'm going to have to pay all this money, that there's viruses going through my network, and that he's even scared that the virus is going to get into his computer, you know? And I have multiple pictures here of his Instagram. We even have a video, some video of his inspirational quotes too, which I'm going to show you guys. But if we go here, we can see there's even more pictures here. Um, tons of pictures here on his Instagram. You can see here more pictures of him, uh, pictures of him with someone else. But yeah, just a bunch of pictures here on his Instagram of him having fun, going out, doing things. And meanwhile, people are sitting in their homes freaking out because someone has just stolen their money from their bank account. We got even more here, more pictures of him on his Instagram. Obviously, everyone else's photos in these, everyone else's uh, faces in these photos are going to be blurred out. So because obviously these people may not know he's a scammer. You know, you can't just assume that, oh, they know he's a scammer. We're going to assume that they don't know it, that he's a scammer. And we're going to focus on just putting the actual scammer on blast here. But yeah, we have even more photos here. All these pictures on his Instagram, him playing pool. Yeah, just tons of pictures here of this scumbag on Instagram. It's it's crazy. And now, now let me show you guys the video here of uh, his just beautiful, his beautiful voice and his inspirational quotes. So here we go. I took this um, while I was uh, streaming. I opened my OBS and recorded this because I figured he would probably delete his Instagram after I called him out. Um, so yeah, here's a here's a nice video of this scammer. Samaj Shastri ki do nayi khojon ke baare mein batata hu. Pehli, jiska koi nahi hota, uska mobile hota hai. और जिसका मोबाइल होता है ये दूसरी है वो किसी का नहीं होता आई मीन जस्ट वाओ जस्ट जस्ट सो इंस्पिरेशनल यू नो just so inspirational you know after a hard hard day uh, at work scamming people you know get home you know make a nice inspirational video i don't i don't under i don't understand what he's saying in the video if someone could translate that in the comments put it below i'd actually like to hear what he's saying if it's a poem or if it's an inspirational quote i'm assuming it's an inspirational quote because a lot of times i find inspirational quotes on scammers computers and i think it's just their way of coping with what they're doing on a daily basis but yeah so we're about to go into the rest of the video here basically this is the second time that i call him and i get on a little bit of a longer call with him so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you enjoy it this next part of it but yeah here we go no okay yeah hi what you want from me um why were you trying to scam me i think you're on a bad connection your voice is breaking i said why why were you trying to scam me Hello. Yeah, hello? Yes, yes, now I can hear you. Yeah, why were you trying to scam me? Well, just to fool. You said what? Nothing, nothing, nothing. I was just bluffing my mouth. Well, can you answer my question? Why, you were, why were you trying to scam me? Uh, what you're expecting. What do you mean? I'm asking you why why were you trying to scam me? You said what was I expecting? Hello? Why aren't you speaking? Hello? Do do you not have anything to say? Muhammad Khalid Khan in New Delhi, State India country or sorry not india but city new delhi state delhi country india 
do you not have anything to say? Or no. you, you're just sitting here quiet? I mean, you stole a bunch of money from a 74-year-old man. Why did you, you had his driver's license on your computer? I don't know what you're saying. You're sort of like something you're taking somewhere from it. You don't know what I'm saying. What do you mean? How do you not know what I'm saying? I'm saying you stole a bunch of money from somebody. If, if I were to know all those things, why would I ask you? Why would you ask me what? Hey, let's just not, you know, put... Let's just not what? You Are you trying to say you're not a scammer now when you Tell picked up my first call saying that you were Walmart? I don't understand, sir. Well... What do you mean? You were just trying to steal my money with a what? Windows pop-up. Can we put the and the bottom line? You said on a better line? Bottom, bottom line. The bottom line of what? Sorry. What? You're cutting out. Let me see one you said you have other yeah, phone yeah, numbers yeah. call me call me back on uh from the number i called you from earlier Okay, may I know the purpose of your phone call? Why you are calling me? Because you just tried to scam me. You just tried to scam me. Why are you when acting like... Uh, you said, when did you scam me? Well, you tried to scam me. With your fake Windows pop-up. What proof do you have it was me? Um... Well, it's all. It was all recorded. It was all recorded. Every every action you did was recorded. Of course, I know. Oh so well, I then why are you saying that? Any if you if you know, then why aren't you admitting it? So what? 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 I, you you keep cutting in and out, man. Do you have a better phone number? Oh, he hung up on me. <laughs> he said he says he said that uh what what proof or whatever and then he says I know you have the proof or something. Tell him I, I he knows I have his info. I just called him by his full name. I just called him by his full name. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, his name is Muhammad. He's, it's it's funny how he's trying to deny it now. Um like that. It's it's funny how he's trying to deny it now when that was literally like he, he just admitted to it, you know? Yeah, it's funny how he's like, what proof? Well, what do you mean? right here basically i went through all these uh gmails and passwords and i found one that worked and i was able to sign in to the scammers zoom account and basically this zoom account is under their numbers they have a main number that forwards to a bunch of different numbers that they have behind that number and this is one of those numbers so when people call their main scam number i am able to pick up the calls and i, I can also see all the call history and logs of people he has called and missed calls he has received from before. So I said, <laughs> I basically have control over their little operation here of, or at least the calls that they are receiving. And I'm able to pick up, answer those calls. I'm able to call people back from their number. So yeah, this is just insane. I don't know how much of this I'm going to leave in the video because after this point of the video, we're about 24 minutes in right now. I end up calling people and taking calls for these scammers until they boot me off, which is about almost two hours I am sitting on here taking calls, telling victims that it's not a scam, calling victims, telling them that it's not a scam. So I'll include a, include a few of those here, but 
I might make a whole version where I can blur, where I blur everything out, maybe put it on Odyssey. Um, we'll see. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. I'll let y'all get to it. And now we're signed in. If we go to phone, here's the history. Wow. So here's all the people that he's called. Hello. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hi. Were you uh, contacted by a number for a Geek Squad or a Norton Charge? I am not. No, I, were you contacted by someone for that? A charge or something no. for, through an email? Yeah, Geek Squad. Yes, I was. Yeah, I, I've, I'm actually I'm a scam baiter, and I I like get back at scammers and stuff, and I got access to one of their phone lines, so I'm just calling people back to tell them that that was a scam. I figured it. Okay, so don't call the number. Yeah, just uh, a any email you get like that, or I don't know if it was a text message or an email. They do it different ways, but anything that you it get. Was an email. Yeah, anything like that. It probably said like all this stuff, your customer ID and all that stuff, and that tells you to give them a call for like a three hundred fifty-eight dollar charge. Pretty much all of those are scams. If it says like Norton, Geek Squad, uh, McAfee, Avast, those are pretty much all usually scams. And you, you'll know if it's a scam if they if they're like if you get into the call and then oh they're trying to like get you to go on your computer or get you to download an app on your phone. Okay. All right. Well. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted well, to make you. make sure. Let oh yeah, know. no problem. Yeah, definitely. Oh. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yes. You have a good one. You too. Bye bye. Right. Bye bye. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh man, I'm gonna have to append this to the end of the video. I'm gonna keep calling. And you can see too because it's highlighted in red who called and and uh who called them. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hi. Um, I'm a a scam baiter, and I basically have access to this line that is being ran by that was being ran by scammers. Who may have contacted you saying that you had a charge for like a Norton or a Geek Squad or some sort of charge for some service renewal? Oh, uh -huh. yeah. And I was just calling. I'm calling all the numbers back that uh, have called the scammer and the scammer has called just to inform them about this. Okay. Scam. So I don't know if you're aware that that was a scam or not, or if anything like that well i figured it was i wasn't really too concerned about it because if it was a five-year renewal i really doubt they have my card number but <laughs> yeah yeah so, absolutely yeah well, well, I, did, I did make a call to find out what the hell because i never signed up for nothing but yeah you can ignore so, that anyways, if you got yeah. an email just delete it or, or block the sender there's no they have no information on you except they have your email address that's it well, they actually said what was weird. They sent to my ex-wife. Oh yeah, they if they have the email, they might have like your name and stuff like that because they basically what they do is they buy uh, data from like companies and people who sell it from different companies. So they might have like maybe a couple different parts, but they won't have everything. Like they uh -huh. won't they won't actually have your credit card, your your debit card, any like right. secure information, but open information like maybe a name an email that you've maybe signed up to different sites and that site sold your data and they oh. somehow ended up getting access to that from that site who sold the data. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, so all right. Probably, I probably won't get a phone call back from the Geek Squad then, right? Uh, yeah, not not today from these guys. <laughs> yeah, definitely <laughs> not. Well, all right, all right well, I appreciate you calling me out to you. Thank you, sir. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you have a good one. Hey, you too. Thanks. Bye-bye. Yeah, bye-bye. Let's go. Yes. <laughs> we out here. We out here. Fuck these scammers, bro. <laughs>
We out here. We got access to your phone line. I'm calling everybody back. Hello? Hello, hey. Yes, hi. Is uh were you calling about a geek squad or a Best Buy charge or something of that sort? Right. Yes, I am actually a scam baiter and I've gotten access to this phone line because that is a scam. That email okay. that you received? Yes. Right. And I've gotten access to right. the scammer's phone line, so I'm just ex accepting calls as they come in to tell people that it's a scam. Thank you, thank you. I was wondering. I didn't remember that. Okay, I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, there's nothing. They don't have any information or nothing. You're totally good to delete it and forget about it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Absolutely. So you work for Best Buy? No, I'm a, I'm what's called a scam baiter, which basically I call oh, scammers please. and I mess with them. I get their information and stuff, and I got access to the scammer's phone line. Excellent, excellent. Thank yeah. you. Okay, bye-bye. Absolutely. Bye-bye. Bye. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Hello. 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 Yes, hello. Are you are you calling hello? about a uh, hello? Can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Can you hear me? Hello. Yes. Who is this? Who is this? Is this support? Is this a scammer? That's the scammer. The scammer just called his own number. No way. No way. Hello? Hello? Yes, this is David. Who is this? This is Rick. Is this the bench out? Hey, Mother Chod. Hey, Mother Hi. Chod. Why did, why did you get the number? Why did I get one number? From where are you talking? You're from US, right? No, I'm from India. <laughs> Bencho, Teramakichu. <laughs> it's the actual scammer. Oh, I'm going to call him for my main number now. Hello? Hello. Yeah, Mr. Hacker. Mr. Benchold, how are, how are you doing, Benchold? Can I ask you I something? I will fuck your ass. Why are you so Benchold? Oh, motherfucker, do you not do not abuse me, Benchold. You see this? I am intercepting all I of will your fuck cars. Your ass. I am intercepting everything, I... Benchold. Oh, do you know you that I Benchold? deleted all the files off of one of your colleagues' computers, too? <laughs> you hung up. <laughs> Mr. Hacker. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, you guys, I'm, I'm working every. I just have to say this right now. I'm working every day to get freaking good videos for the for you guys. So this makes me so happy knowing that this is the type of stuff that you guys want me to do, and it's the video that I'm able to get you right now. It makes. I don't think you guys understand how happy I am right now that I'm able to do this for you guys, and that I'm able to do this and intercept scam victims that are calling this number. I think it's freaking awesome it's it's uh, it's crazy it's this is gonna make my whole year hello hello yeah hi hi are um, you so yes uh, yeah i had i had some problems with the the thing you know the thing the uh, venture the Bencho thing with the Chutias and the Terimaki Chutes. Oh my god, are you scammer vaults? Yeah. <laughs> Seriously? Oh my god, yes. man, what the heck? I wasn't kidding when I had access. <laughs> okay, I didn't even know what the number was really about. I just saw the Geek Squad thing in the, in the, in the comments. 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Geek. So sorry, yeah. Dude, I, I enjoy your videos so much. Holy crap, man. Hell yeah, man. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Damn. Okay. I Wow, this is kind of weird, man. Okay, yeah, cool. it's yeah. I mean, it's it is kind of weird when you call a scammer's number and then all of a sudden I pick up. <laughs> it, it's yeah, not, it's not expected, I right? Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I definitely get that. All right, but yeah, man. I, don't, I, I really, I don't really have much to say except like, thanks for doing your videos, man. It's kind of cool, like, dude. Heck yeah. I, I don't know. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting them, man. Yeah. Thanks for Dude, subscribing course. to the channel I, and all that. That's freaking dope. Yeah. I, I was really sad when you left for a few months. Um, yeah. You know, but but as he, I'm I back, mean, I'm full back tilt, back. you know, uh, everything is, I've got a lot of different videos I'm trying. You, you know, there's going to be a lot coming out. So, yeah, definitely, man. Dude, thank you. Seriously, thank you for supporting, watching the videos. Freaking just seeing my post right now. That's freaking awesome. Yeah, of course. Heck yeah, man. Well, all right. I'm a, I'm I mean, a, I, I, oh, I'm sorry. What? But I said I don't really got other like anything other to say much than that. I mean, I was planning on calling a scammer and calling him a dirty bench show. But, <laughs> yeah, <know>. definitely, <laughs> dude. That's freaking dope. Yeah, you guys are. It's safe to say you guys are killing this number right now. It's actually pretty hilarious watching just calls come through like every 30 seconds. It's pretty funny. Wait, so is this your number or is this a scammer's number that you're like tapping into? It's a scammer's number that I have direct access to. Okay, sweet, yeah. man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm literally in his Zoom software right now picking up calls. So, yeah. yeah. That's awesome. Get him. Get him. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, I've already All picked right. up like probably, probably over four different victims' calls, and I've called a bunch of people back. So, yeah, these scammers yeah, are having a very unprofitable day. Good, good. Heck yeah, good. man. I'll, I'll leave you to it, dude. All right, you peace out, man. You have a good day. Thank you for watching the video. Seriously. Yeah, yeah. yeah, of course. All right, bye. Bye, man. Let's go. You guys are so cool. Oh, man. Every person I've picked up, you guys are either doing something funny or you're just, like, freaking super cool when you when I pick up. <laughs> this is this is great. I might have to... Uh, the editing... I don't know how... This is going to be, like... Even after all the editing, this is going to be a pretty long video. I can already tell. Because I'm going to include a lot of this because I know you guys are going to want to see it. And man, I need to start live streaming again too. I know I get so many questions about it. Start live streaming. It's just the thing is when I'm calling scammers, there's a lot of times where I'm just sitting there and there's no numbers that are active. So I'm sitting here and it's like just inactive. Oh, that didn't even go. But yeah, there's like no numbers active. So it's like, it's just me sitting here. <laughs> so that's basically what happens sometimes. And you t Twitch. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hello. Hi, yeah, is this a Geek Squad uh, support? Uh, no, this is Scammer Revolt support now. I took over. Oh. Yeah. Well, nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, man? What's it, up? It was Geek Squad. Hey, I love your work. Dude, uh, thank it you, was man. Geek Squad. Yeah, they still have the IVR up, or they're the using Zoom as a Geek Squad. Oh yeah, mm. yeah. I, I, I've they've they've called me from another number a few times, and they're like, "Oh, are uh -huh. you the hacker?" And I'm like, "Yeah, what are you doing, Bencho?" <laughs> and he starts getting all sexual and stuff, and I'm like, "Whoa, okay, what's going on here?" You know? <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, I've been on their phone for <laughs> probably an hour and thirty minutes now. Oh dang! You got both of their numbers, right? You got the other one too, right? The original uh, from it's, message. It's one. Oh, they're actually calling me right now. <laughs> the scammers. <laughs> I'm gonna pick this right, up real quick. All right. Business, yeah. All right. Thank okay, you, man. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. All right see ya. Hello. Hello, Benchod. Bankalor. Chutia. Why aren't you talking?
Hello? Chutia, I know you can hear me. <laughs> he hangs up. Let me call him back. He hangs up. What? Why just... I should have stayed on the call with the other guy. This guy was like, hello? Chutia. Benchod, why don't you want to speak now? You call me, you make all those sexual references earlier, and now you're just being quiet on the phone? What's wrong with you? Are you scared? Scammer. <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> oh, it's funny how bad they got. Now, now he just wants... He, I think he's just calling to see if I'm still on the phone, if I still have access. I think they're trying to figure out how I have access, and so he's calling and being like, oh, how do, let's see if he still has access. Motherfucker, yeah, and in Thailand, who, who, who's running this location in Thailand? Huh? Who's your Why mule? Why do I tell you? Who's your mule? Why the fuck will I tell you? Because you I'm gonna report it, you motherfucker. I don't know if You're Thailand will do my anything, dick. but fuck you, bitch. Show, I deleted all, I deleted all your, your shit. Ass, I deleted Shove all your crap. What are you gonna do about it? Yo, guys, what is up? It's Camera Vaults here, bringing you guys an insane video. This video is crazy. There's rage, file deletions, and at one point, I get control of the scammer's phone server. This is just crazy. Definitely not a video you want to skip through because there's multiple parts to this video. But yeah, before this video starts, if you guys aren't following me on Twitch, I've started doing Twitch streams again. I did three streams last week. Check out my Twitch channel. It'll be the top link in the description below. Twitch.tv slash Gamma Revolts. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, give it a like and share it. But yeah, let's get to the video. Leave your mouse. Okay, I'm not touching okay, it. Okay, so now... Now it is working fine. Just be on the line. Let me generate the ID for you. It's going to take a few moments. Yeah, because you were saying before I had to fill out a cancellation form. Yo, guys. Future Vaults here. Now, the last couple of videos, I've been doing these voiceovers, and you guys have really been liking them. So I just kind of want to go over and do a little voiceover and explain to you guys what is happening right now and cut out some of the boring stuff. So basically what I'm doing right now is I'm connected to the scammer's computer everything you can see on the screen is his files on the left is my file system and on the right is his file system so i'm going through all of his files and i'm basically finding things that are interesting to me that might have information for him or might have victim information and i'm going through all the files and i'm downloading it onto my computer before i go ahead and then delete all his files so what you're about to see right now is we're going to go forward to when I actually go and delete all the files off of his computer. And this deletes all the files that he has stored and created on this computer. So all of his scam victim information, all that stuff is deleted off his computer. And as you can see, or you will see in the towards the end of this video, he has had this computer scamming people for quite a while. So that is what we're about to do. We're about to fast forward to when I go and I delete all of his files. Yeah. Uh, just asking for a customer feedback, like where our customer belongs to. Okay. I'm from Dallas, Texas as well. Oh, really? I'm in San Antonio. Mm -hmm. Um, working here right now in New Jersey, Patterson, but I'm from Dallas. Oh, okay. I was about to say New Jer New Jersey's not in Texas exactly. <laughs> yeah, but I'm working over here. I'm outside Texas, you know. Yeah. So I, once your cancellation will go on process, you will get to see a black screen like work securely. As soon as you see it, just let me know. Okay, yeah. So what's going to come up? So we have canceled your subscription and now we are initiating the amount back to your account, which is your check-in account for your... Oh. Is my them wall, back, why is my sir? wallpaper gone? It will be back, sir, because your process is still going on. So it will be back. You need to wait. Okay.
Hello? Yes, I'm here. Is it back now? It's still black. Yo, guys, future revolts here. Now, this is, this is crazy what I'm about to tell you guys. So, the scammer just disconnected me, right? This, this is about three days later that I'm recording this. But the scammer disconnected me, right? And you're, trust me, you're not going to want to skip this part of the video. We're, we're going to get to the scammer rage. I know everybody likes the scammer rage. But the scammer rage is going to be so much better with the information that I tell you. Okay? So this is a few days later. Alright? Um, basically, I looked through all the, the files that I downloaded from the scammer. He has stolen a lot of money. And I also found some other stuff in his file. Because as you look here, I'm downloading files off of his phone server right now. I'm downloading call logs off of his phone server. I've downloaded over 22,000 files off of his phone server. All call logs. <laughs> and I've effectively destroyed his phone server. But let's wait. Let's wait till we get to that. First, I want to show you guys how much of a scumbag this scammer is. So, example one. Let's open this here. Outgoing wire transfer. $99,400. You're seeing that right. This scammer stole $99,400. $400 from someone as you can see it has the beneficiary address and all that stuff which I'm going to show you guys that but I want to show you guys that he's even a bigger douchebag I know $99,400 that's a pretty big douchebag but he's an even bigger douchebag because um, if we go here here's another picture of that $99,400 that we saw here's the other uh, beneficiary information page here right but if we go down here, you can see there's another one that says receipt. $29,000. He has stolen over $100,000 from people. And this is all in this year alone. This scammer has stolen over $100,000 from people, which is just insane. Okay. He has stolen over $129,000. $129,000 from people. So, yeah, that's how big of a douchebag this guy is. I just wanted you guys to know. Oh, and also he's stolen uh, money from people via iTunes or Apple gift cards, too. We have this here. We have another picture of him stealing people's information. You can see they're in their car. So people actually fell for it and went and drove to the store. And, uh, yeah, basically got their money stolen. But, so, I was looking through all these files and stuff, and I see this file here called Dialer. And keep this in mind, this is today. I missed this during the original video. So, you're probably wondering, like, why are you recording this three days later? I missed this. So, I go to Dialer and I open it. It's his login information for the voice server. For his, for his Vicky Dialer server. His, his phone server. It's, it's the login information for it. So... What do I do? I take that and I log in. <laughs> As you can see, I log in um, and I have fully destroyed this. Now, before I go to that, let me show you the location that the people were sending their money to. And you could already see the one star reviews from people who have been scammed, leaving reviews on this location. Um, yeah, this is a uh, Sriracha Food and Starch Co. Limited. Yeah. This is the location that they are sending money to, apparently. And you can see here the reviews. Scam, fake website, fake address. After payment, they're gone. You can see here multiple people. So these are people that he scammed, unfortunately. Um, yeah, you can see using WhatsApp and then they disappear. It looks like the same thing all the time. Scammer, avoid this place, avoid the name. You can see here, after payment, they're gone. Fake website. Transfer money through Western Union. No more reply, and they're gone. As you, these, could be, these could be the people, one of the people who freaking got scammed $99,000. You know? Do not make any transaction, as you can see here. And it's not, it's not from that long ago. Um, but yeah, so this is basically their meal where they're sending money through um, in Th Thailand. But yeah, if we go here, you can see I fully destroyed this. If we go to their campaigns, I've deleted their campaigns. All the lists, it's all Hello Scammers. <laughs> their script, I left a nice little script here. 
Hey scammer, here is your script. You're a dummy head scammer. The filters. Hello scammer. <laughs> it's it's all a hello scammers or deleted. There's no in between. It's either hello scammers or I deleted it. As you can see, everything here. Hello scammers. <laughs> the user groups. I couldn't change that. The remote agents. All deleted. The admin page. The phones. I deleted all the phones accounts. And these are all their user accounts. So basically on Monday... When they come in and they say, oh, we're going to scam people, none of it's going to work. <laughs> none of it's going to work. And plus, I have all this downloaded. So some people be like, well, wait, wait, wait. Why'd you just delete it all? You might want to keep that. That could be useful. I have it all. It's all on my computer. Um, I have all the information here, all the IP addresses of the computers that were set up on the phone accounts. I have all of the voice recordings. This one's a small one, right? Oh, 4,527 items, um, 5,352 items, and I didn't even tell you all about that. I told you about the, did I, or did I tell you? <laughs> 24,000 items out of 43,000 that it's downloading. That's what this is right now. It's downloading it all from their server. It's a wget um, command going through on a list of links from the, from the index page. Uh, downloading all of their call recordings so I actually we can go through a couple of these too because I know this this is probably interesting and, and guess what types of other scams they're running um, let, let's see if we can get one that that so I don't even have to tell you guys and you could just see it for yourself here we go let's, let's see this one hello hello um, I speak to Kate Gwen. Oh, immediate hang up. Uh, uh, a bunch of these are actually immediate hang ups. People are people are realizing um, that it's a that it's a scam and just hanging up. Some of these are just taking forever to open. Hello. 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 Who's this? Yeah, I'm speaking with Emma. Emma Love. Cold yeah. calling people. Thank you. Emma, this is yeah. Emma, this is Kevin here. I'm calling you from the Visa and Mastercard verification department. The Visa you? and Mastercard verification department. And she hung up. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, that's what a lot of these are. They're calling from the Visa yeah. Mastercard verification department or the grant department. So yeah. And this one's just quiet. If anyone had any doubt that these are scams, there you go. Um, and then these, they, th there's a bunch of calls to people in the UK and the US. So they're scamming both the UK and the US, which is just horrible. But yeah, I've, I've, I've also downloaded all their call lists too. I have that in a folder somewhere else, which is basically all the lists of the numbers that they have um, to call people. They're, they're dialing campaigns. I've downloaded all those too. So I have everything downloaded from their server, and then I went through and I deleted, renamed, changed, changed all the configuration, deleted their carriers, all that stuff. So the system either is going to have to be totally reset and reconfigured from the bottom up, and that means all that dialing information is going to ha all have to be re-entered and re-uploaded and all that stuff, or they're going to have to go through and figure out what I screwed up and fix it, which is going to take forever. <laughs> so it's going to take a good while. It's going to waste a good bit of time which is what we want here because these guys suck. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so um, basically what what is happening right now is I am recording this a few days later. So I'm going to insert this into the video and where we're about where you guys are about to see is uh, a little bit after when my session got disconnected, maybe about 10 minutes later, the guy calls me back and I just want you to keep in mind all of this stuff while he's, talking trash, raging at me, um, being kind of racist too, you'll see in some parts. Um, but yeah, totally horrible guy, totally deserves this. So stolen hundreds of thousands of dollars. And yeah, screw scammers. I really hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. And if you do, give it a like and please share this video. But yeah, on to the scammer rage. Huh? Does Hello. 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 Yes. Hey, Hi. what's up? You playing games and shit, you motherfucker? Yeah, I got your files, motherfucker. Suck them. Yeah, you stole over a hundred thousand dollars, you piece of shit. Yeah, you motherfucker. Yeah, yeah in Thailand. Right. Who, who who's running this location in Thailand? Huh? Who's your Why mule? Why do I tell you? Who's your mule? Why the fuck will I tell you? Because you I'm gonna report it, you motherfucker.
I don't know you if Thailand will do anything, my dick. but fuck you, bitch. Show, show I deleted all, I deleted all your, your shit. Ass, I deleted all in. your crap. What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do you about know, it, Ben? I have Show. dozen of computers I use for this shit. Yeah, and I know you've been using this one for over a year. I found your fake uh, little gonna, email document template here. You're going to shave you're going to shave my balls. Are you Osman? Who's Osman? Why is the name of this file not called Osman? Uh, some of your you guys, you bunch of motherfuckers over there, we fucked up. Huh? Osman with the 10,000 phone numbers in it? I bet I bet that was a a pretty expensive data packet that you bought. No, not at all. That one was an expensive pretty, shit, pretty cheap. Uh, pretty, cheap pretty cheap, pretty cheap, but you keep calling us. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Because you, you don't got nothing better to do. You're you're shameful. Got, your whole you, country's ashamed you got of a you, lot and of so money. is your family. You, you want to hear so what something? you're doing right now? What I'm you're here doing with your right wife. now? That's I don't I'm have doing. a wife, you motherfucker. Look at I'm fucking your daughter right now. Oh, I'm sorry. It's your mom. Oh, it's okay. I'm sorry. It, she's so she's she's always talking about you. She's always ta telling me about you. <laughs> he hung up. Oh wow, he was bad. Okay, I didn't expect that. Okay, let me call back. Yeah, you know he he says he has so many computers and stuff, but he seems pretty uh, pretty annoyed by that. <laughs> Let's call back. Text now subscriber uh, you are trying to reach is not available. Uh, let me leave Please leave your message now. after the tone. Why why do you hang up? You don't want to talk, you coward. You I mean, you say you have so many you say you have so many computers and it's so cheap to get these files, but you're so mad. You're like a little whiny baby calling me and whining to me that I got your files, Ben Chode. Why don't why don't you pick up the call and talk? I'm looking on the the Google Maps at your location and I can see the reviews of the people saying that it was a scam um yeah i should make a complaint about this location and get get your get your meal shut down <laughs> let's let's see let's see what he if he if he picks up again or right, let's uh, oh he just tried calling me back hello hello ben chode you fucking coward what the fuck bro what the fuck bro why do you hang up you fucking what? Because you, because you get, you you get all mad. Bitch. You call. You cry and whine to me because you're because too you're stupid to secure bitch. your computer. You are son of Suck a bitch. My dick. That's why you're scamming people for a living. Suck my dick, bro. Suck my How dick, bro. And suck my brother's dick. Suck my fucking dick, bro. Fuck you, Ben Chode. You motherfucker. Uh, you you like being a stupid scammer? Where's where's your brother? Where's let me talk to another scammer. Hey motherfucker. Hey motherfucker. <laughs> wow, I think another call was coming in. I heard I heard boop boop in the background. I think someone else was calling in cuz uh, the number's on TSU now, so Let me see. I gotta call this guy again. <laughs> Got some interesting information from him too, you know. Not anything crazy like last video, you know, finding the the guy's actual location. But yeah, let's let's call back. I know you guys like it. Every you know you know me. I always call back. I call back until I can't call back anymore. That's how it goes. ringing you were trying to reach is not available please leave your message after the tone let, let me let me see if he picks up on the other if if he blocked my other number too because that one is not blocked but he didn't pick up let me see if this one's blocked you are trying to reach is no longer in service yeah now now he's blocking my numbers okay okay You clicked on no, sir. On where? It just came away and went. You didn't have to click on no, sir. You have to click on yes. Well, you said to click on it. You you clicked on yes, right? You did. You on have, here. you clicked on no, sir. You don't have to click on no. You have to click on yes. 
Okay. It's there, sir. It's there. Where? Look on the task. Uh, look on the task bar, sir. On the bottom of your task bar. After all that stalling. On the extreme right, you see this all blue the files box deleted. with an arrow in it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, I see it. Yes, sir. Click on that. Yes, yeah. Click on the run box. Click on run only. Run only. Check mark run only. Yo guys, what's up? Future Revolts here. So this part of the video I'm going through, I'm basically, I was going to start uploading all the files to the scammer's computer like I usually do, but I figured, you know, I got a pretty interesting opportunity here. I have literally all of this guy's photos. I have over 800 photos and that's not all wallpapers. That's like a, that's a bunch of photos as you can see on the screen right now, tons and tons of photos from this guy's call center people he's he works with i actually end up finding like the buildings where he lives at based off of his pictures and some other information which y'all are going to see at the end but so what i'm doing right now is i'm going through and i'm compressing everything and i'm sending it to myself so i can have it on my host machine and put it back on my other vm without him really noticing because obviously if i go through and i open like a google chrome page to download something it's going to freak him out i'm trying to do it without him noticing to basically see you know i want to see his reaction when all this stuff pops up and it seems familiar to him so that's what ha that's what's happening right now and it ends up being a little bit long so i'm cutting it down and putting this voice over here uh, i got a few comments saying the voiceovers were cool and stuff so i'll probably start doing this in more videos yeah so i'm basically zipping the files up sending it to myself and then sending it back to my other virtual machine that's what we're about to cut to is to where I'm basically grabbing a bulk of pi a big bulk of the pictures and just dragging it to the desktop. Might be because of the spyware, sir. Those are pictures off of his computer in the background. Hello? Yes, I'm here, sir. Okay. go ahead and write it down okay you think he knows <laughs> you think he sees it hello yes I'm here sir I'm with you I wonder if he's trying to delete the files <laughs> hello what is all these pictures? Hey, I don't know. Is sir. that you, scammer? Is it? Is that you? No. All the pictures no, that I got off your computer, that's not you? I have all your pictures here. No, sir. Why'd you disconnect? I, I, have, disconnect I have all of your sir. pictures here. I have every single picture, and I deleted it all off of your computer, too. It's all mine now. Do you, do you like being a scammer? That's not my intention. It is yours. That's not me. I could, I could hear you hyperventilating over the phone <laughs> as you tried to okay. delete everything. Is that why you highlighted everything? You tried to delete it? <laughs> do no, you, sir, you like, would do I you do like that? scamming people? Is that you with cake on your face? No, is this sir, your birthday celebration? No, that's not my birthday celebration, sir. It's not yours, so if I post these pictures along with your your number, that's okay, right? Because that's what I'm going to do. I'm sorry? 
I'm gonna post these pictures online with your what scammer you number. Do? And you you like cryptocurrency too, right? I saw you had some screenshots of some cryptocurrency. You wanted to buy some guitars too, on Amazon. And also, I had a picture here. It says that you were ordering food. Um, no, sir. Uh, why would I be ordering food? Well, it's Hashapar Hashaparo Village, Sector Fifty One. That's not anywhere by you. Adar Pradesh. No, sir. I th I think it is. Yeah, I, th I no, think sir, these are your pictures sir. that I got off That's... your laptop. Who is it if it's not you? That's good, sir. That... I don't know, sir. That's not me. You notice how I stayed on the phone? <laughs> it is you. Why don't you just admit it and stop being a coward scammer? Why would I be admitted, sir? Well, because you're a scammer and you should use whatever dignity you have left to at least admit to your scam. That's not me, sir. Why would I admit it? Because it is you. I have multiple pictures. I have, I have literally all of your pictures downloaded. Even your wallpapers. Your anime Naruto wallpapers. I have all those, too. <laughs> yeah. So, do you like scamming people? I have all these pictures of the, the pictures of your laptop that you took, too, after you scammed people. I have all those, too. I didn't do, sir. That's not me, sir. Well, you obviously did do it. It was on your computer. Your what? You, I think it was in your OneDrive folder, right? Yeah, this this is all your stuff. No, sir, that's not mine. Yes, it is. Connect back. You have to admit it, you can admit it, sir. Huh? Why don't you connect back on TeamViewer? You have to admit it, you can. Why don't you connect back on TeamViewer? <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> oh, he is spooked. He did not want to admit it at all. Oh my gosh. There's literally... Look at this. It's a zoomed in screenshot of his, his food order. Dude took a screenshot of the of the page showing his delivery status. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh he literally okay <laughs> he he didn't want to admit it i'm sitting here with all of it and you saw okay he said it wasn't his right you guys saw i didn't say anything i put the pictures like this he went dead quiet and he goes like this let's take the notepad he goes like this the notepad's like this and he goes you just hear him like breathing and you hear the, the ambient sounds from his microphone as he's just super quiet. He's like, how the fuck are these on his computer? <laughs> oh my gosh. I got to call back. I got to call back. I'm calling back. Let's see if this coward will even pick up. It's ringing. Ah. Right now, but please leave a message and someone will get back to you as soon as possible. <laughs> Hey scammer, what what happened? You you said it wasn't you and then you disconnected and closed all your stuff. I I can't even connect to your team viewer now. What what happened? I I mean, yeah, it's all your pictures. Why didn't, why can't you at least admit that you're scamming people? You're stealing people's money? Stealing people's money? There's multiple pictures on here of you stealing people's money their money you hear how i keep saying their money it's not your money to steal why are you stealing it come on i have i have literally pictures of you you're the one with cake on his face i've been through this before with other scammers all right i know this is like a a, a birthday celebration tradition thing all right they put cake on the face of the guy whose birthday it is okay i, I know how it works i've already talked to another scammer about this before but he at least admitted it you, you, you just freaked out. <laughs> I mean, maybe don't take screenshots of the food you're ordering. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, I hung up. 
He's just he. he <laughs> Yeah, I have, there's, there's, let me show you guys, you guys saw all the pictures there, there's, literally, there's hundreds of pictures. Okay, so, future revolts here, this is about, I don't know, uh, a week, or like, not a week, like, four days after, um, the last clip that you just saw. So, basically, I've been going through the files, and I found something interesting, so, I don't think the guy's pictures that I showed him might be the person exactly I was speaking to and I think it's actually a group of scammers in a call center working together and they might actually be friends so <laughs> let me show you here this this is the guy that I think I was talking to you see the picture of him here you can see the computer right you see the call software and you see they also have zoom open um and then I can kind of, I feel like I can see, I think there's any desk and team viewer open in the taskbar. And obviously it's in a call center, it's a computer at a desk, right? So <laughs> let's go over here now. So close this, right? I have a bunch of pictures here. I go over here. Who do we see? The same guy in the group, right? Same guy. And then I go to the actual pictures of him stealing information. Here is him looking at somebody's saved passwords. You see the call software open, any desk, team viewer, right? Windows 7. Okay, what computer is this running? Windows 7, right? <laughs> so then I'm like, oh, okay. So I go over here. It's another thing, and I, I want you to notice something. It's another one of him looking at someone's information. You see a watermark down here, right, for the phone. It, the phone's camera, I guess, leaves a watermark. You see here this watermark with these two dots, right? And I'm looking through it, and then we look at the pictures of the, the houses. Look at that, the watermark is there, <laughs> right? And then I go over here, another one of him uh, copying someone's information. The watermark is there. Well, this one isn't really cut. It's, it's a picture of his UltraViewer, but yeah, the watermark is there, right? We go over here, him stealing someone's credit card information. Right? And all these pictures. That one doesn't have the watermark, but I'm looking at all these. And I'm like, huh, that's that's curious. Let's look at this selfie. Right? Let's zoom out. Oh, what is that? Redmi Note 6 Pro dual camera. Let's look at another one in the call center. This time it looks like this guy's taking the picture. Redmi Note 6 Pro. Oh, who else is in the background? That guy. And what are they doing? They're in a call center on computers at night. And you know what scammers do? They stay up at night because that's when we are awake during the day so they can scam us. Right? You get you get where I'm going here? You know? So we have a couple more pictures like that. Zoom out here. You can see the back of the call center, all the little cubicles and stuff, right? Um, so I'm just looking at these and I see all this and I see another selfie that he took. The watermark. It's it's the watermark. <laughs> so I'm looking at this and I'm like, okay, wait. So this has to be a group because all these guys here, they're all hanging out. They're in the same call center. They're taking pictures with each other in the call center. You can see another one here. This one doesn't have the watermark, but you can see the same two people. You see the computer back there. It has TeamViewer installed on it. Running Windows 7. Same layout, right? So I'm looking at it and I'm like, okay, so this must be, I'm thinking this must be the guy that I was talking to because he's the one, or it was one of the other guys that I, uh, uh, that I was talking to, but they're from the same group because they all have, he has, there's all these pictures of them all together. And then along with that, there's these pictures with the watermark of the, of the computers where they are stealing people's information. So this is, I'm pretty sure this guy's phone taking the pictures and then in these pictures the other guys just has his phone taking the pictures so i think that's what's happening here this is the guy that is that i was talking to and that's why i think he was like oh no you know as you saw his reaction he got quiet but he was always like, oh yes that's not me that's not me you know <laughs> so you know i'm looking here there's another picture of him it looks like at like comic con um, and then here he has screenshots of his Instagram 
And that picture I just showed you is his Instagram picture. So these are his pictures, right? So I go here, the pictures of the buildings, the watermarks, right? The watermarks. So what I did is I looked this up and at first I thought this order was for his address, for his house. I thought this was his house. Okay. But I go, I go to that location and it looks like, um, you know, it, it looks like a building with a bunch of shopping centers. So I was like, okay, then he must be the blue dot. Right, because there's a two here, which probably means the courier is getting two orders, and then the blue dot is you. Right? So I'm looking at it and I'm like, okay, that's not that far. So I went on Google Maps and I retraced it. Now I want you to look at this picture here. <laughs> sorry, sorry if I'm going a little fast, okay? So I, I went on Google Maps. I you know, we see all these watermarks here. It's all adding up. The guy taking the picture of the computers where people have been scammed out of their information. They have all their private details here. All the bullcrap support here. And he's taking pictures of it to steal their information, right? Keep it for himself. You know, we go over here. He has an Amazon screenshot. Nodia201305. Abishik. I think that's his name. Abishik. But... So we go here and here's the address. I go to that address and I look at the map and I look at the map on Google Maps compared to here. Right? And then guess what? <laughs> so we look at this photo here, right? You see these buildings here and you see this building here and there's something red on top. You see the two windows and then you see the windows down here with a little bit of damage under them. Look at this. We go here. What do you see? You go here and there's the building. Right there. You see the red on the top? You see that? The red on the top? You see the two windows? And then the two windows with some damage underneath, right? Two windows. Two windows with damage underneath. This is the center that he lives in. Not on this one. I believe he lives in this one. Because there's another photo, I don't know if I have it on here, but there's another photo where he also gets an angle of this building by the entrance. Or like pointed towards the entrance, and the entrance is that way. So if we go over here, down this way, and what do you see? You see the entrance over here, right? <laughs> so this is where the guy... This is where he lives, basically. Um, he ordered food while he was scamming people, I'm guessing. Took a screenshot of it and had pictures <laughs> of his house, you know, out of his uh, apartment building, I guess. But I'm guessing he lives somewhere around here, you know, or up here. Because he has, picture he has pictures from inside going out and there's a building with these pillars on top. How it kind of looks unfinished almost. There's pillars like that at the top of the building uh, in the other photo that he took. Yeah, you see here? Zoom out here. You see these pillars right there? And we go up here. <laughs> you see that? And then you go over here. You see the red architecture up here. You see the two windows and these two. And it's damaged underneath. And then you go over here. To this one. Oh wow, this one's actually a better quality one, but it's not as high. So you can't see the red thing, but you can see the damage under the windows, and you can see how all the windows are stacked. And then if we go to this one, that shows the top, but it's a little blurry. Oh, this one's actually better quality. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, there you go. You can see it right there. You see the red? Let's let's do a little a little drawing like the scammers like to do. <laughs> You can see right there at the top of the building, the red. And then there you go. So this is the scammer's location, and I'm pretty sure that it is a little group of scammers operating together um, instead of just one guy. Because as you can see from these pictures, there's... Uh, it's, it's clear as day. <laughs> the watermarks, 
the the selfies the clear selfies this one you, you know it's not at the office right he's in a car so you can't be like oh it was someone else's phone it's not his phone no he's in a car you know oh he's in the he's on the top of a fucking building <laughs> you know so i think this is his phone and these are his these are his friends slash other people that he scams with because you can see pictures of the call center with them you can see this one here of him in the call center um and then we got this one of this guy in the call center too with him and another guy in the call center it's nighttime so they can scam people at night um this took me a little bit <laughs> i was i was i was i probably spent like six hours today just finding looking up information on this guy <laughs> uh, got a little frustrated at times but yeah so i i found all this information on him it's obvious that this this guy is running a scam with a bunch of other people here which is like dude come on you, you guys are friends and you you know you they just got the it's it's the crappiest group of people ever <laughs> you know hey let, hey guys let's go out and let's let's scam people you know oh did i close that but yeah so you can literally see it here if we go if we go here you know it's it's his building that's where he was that's where they are or he is that's where he lives you can see from the camera watermarks and all that stuff um but yeah, so if you guys like this video, uh, please give it a like. We got that reaction from the scammer was hilarious. Um, he he really thought that he, you know, I don't know. He thought he was going to get a payday. And then, boom, next thing you know, we have pictures of them, of them, multiple scammers all running their little operation. We have the location of him. Um, we can go here and do the street view. Or not the street view, do the satellite view. Go by satellite. So if we zoom in here, and you see here, Nodia, we go over here, we go to here, deliver to, this is his name, and then Nodia, 210305. Um, and that's where this is. <laughs> so multiple sources of confirmation on this one. Um, these are the buildings that he lives at. And. Yeah, so I don't know. If you guys like this video, please give it a like. Another crazy video. I think this video is absolutely insane. Uh, the reaction from the guy, how he just goes silent and it's just like, uh, you know, you can literally see him slowly drag over, you know, the, the notepad and he's like, what? <laughs> but... Maybe he just thought I wasn't going to look into it more than just seeing the pictures. But obviously I did. I, I went through over 800. I have 807 of this dude's pictures. <laughs> and I thought it was going to be all like wallpapers when I was downloading it. Because he had a bunch of anime wallpapers. No, most of it is this stuff. It's it's pictures of people's computers that he stole from. It's, it's pictures of him. Pictures of his friends. A bunch of pictures of him at Comic Con. All this different stuff. And, you know, this guy's going out having fun. And then at night he's going in and doing stuff like this and stealing from people. So screw him. He's a piece of crap. But, yeah, I'm going to end this video here. Um okay, I just want to make sure. Okay. So, uh, hello? I'm sorry, couldn't get that. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah, I, I just had a question. Yes, sir. Go ahead. So this is this is Amazon, right? Yes, sir. We are Amazon. Okay. Well, can I can I ask you why you're uh, yes, scamming sir. people? Sir, why would we scam anyone? Web why, IT why you Park. That? West I'm Bengal, sorry? 734010 India. Can I ask you why you're working for RRSSR Private Limited scamming people? Sir, the, I'm sorry, I can I can understand RRSSR. 
What yes, you this is your building that you're in right now. Why are you scamming people? No, sir. We're not yes. scamming anyone. You are scamming people? Webel IT Park? Uh, sir, I do not know what are you saying. You don't know what I'm saying? Well, what I'm saying is you're scamming people out of this building right here. Is this the office that you're in right now? Sir, you're wrong. I'm not wrong. Okay, how, how, why would you think that? Why would I say that? Because you're a scammer. I'm not a scammer. Yes, you are. Here's pictures of your call center. And here's your call center. Hello, Benchoed? Yes, sir. I, I'm sorry. I'm really scared right now. You're scared? Well, then why are you yes, scamming sir. people if you're scared when you get exposed? You tell me what, what I'm supposed to do. What are you supposed to do? You're supposed to make an honest living and not steal people's money and making them homeless. That'd be something that you're supposed to do. You're not making anyone homeless. Yes, you are. You're stealing millions of dollars. That's not us. That is you. That's not you? You're not the scammer? You don't scam people? Is what You're saying you don't scam people. I work for a salary. Okay, that's what I do. I make a living. No, you don't make a living. You scam people. I... I have a college education. I'm a graduate. Okay, so you have problems with education and you think it's your right to steal people's money. You know there's been people that have taken their own lives because they've been scammed? People die every day, come on. Uh, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because you... Okay. Come on, you think it's okay for China to... To uh, spread this scam around the whole world, uh, named COVID, and it's cool, and they <laughs> you, take you, all the all the, all the money from people, and and that's okay. I'm, I'm talking we'll about be, you. Oh, Why are you oh, stealing stop, from people? Stop you stop, stop it, Mother Child. Take some take some you accountability for your actions, huh? Yes. Uh, tell tell the U.S. government to take accountability for what they have done. How about I tell your local police officers? Okay, you can do that too. Yes, I will. I will be making a report. You know, there, uh, you, uh, it's okay, but do you, do you know there is... Uh, I know. You have your day is, operations. You have your night operations. I know. Listen to me, motherfucker. There is a greed <laughs> named bribery. Do you know that? There's a greed. Uh, it's all in the economy. It's, yes. It's called a greed. You know that? Yes. It's called bribery. It's called oh, money. yeah. I'm well aware. Yeah. I'm still going to make the report. I don't care. This this matter? information yes, will be understand. this information will be published and a lot of people are going to see it. Understand this, okay? What I'm saying, please understand this. Yeah. You wouldn't make a dent out of this, okay? <laughs> Jim Browning tried to do this and uh, he couldn't make a dent as well. To you Nothing guys? Oh yeah, you you watch Jim Browning? You don't you don't even have you don't even have a clue. I don't have a clue. Have a clue. Yes, I you're right. I I have no clue, huh? This is just the tip of the iceberg that you're saying. There are politicians involved. There are polit everyone is involved, man. What are you saying? Yeah. Why it's do you think wrong. we're here? Why do you think we're Carl here Rock. doing their job listen, for them? Listen, listen, listen to me. Carl Rock. He deliberately married an Indian woman. <laughs> you know, oh, you, you know a lot about a lot of scam baiters, huh? You know Carl Rock. Come on. Come on, he couldn't do anything. He's not banned from the Indian government. <laughs> I believe you know that. So uh, it wouldn't make a difference. Please understand me. It wouldn't make a difference. Are you sure? With your tax invoices uh, that I have too. You pay around five hundred ninety dollars a month for the internet there. Uh, <laughs> Would you like to see it? Would you like to see it? If you're trying to scare me with documents, it's okay. You can do that, but I'm not scared. The problem is, the problem is. Well, yeah, you're probably not scared because you just work there, right? You don't actually run anything. You get the little pebbles. You don't get the big dollars, huh? It's okay. It's okay. Okay, it's okay. Uh, it, it's even okay for for everyone in in the building. 
it's okay because people wouldn't change. And come on, man, this is the economy right now of of, of this area that you're talking about. Yeah. The, the, yeah, it's an economy here. It's an economy to scam job. people. Well, why did you say uh, you were scared at first? Uh, just because uh, you are. <laughs> because what? Because you're so stupid. You, you think that it, it would make a difference. You're, okay, you, you're going gonna, gonna to show me my, my, my tax invoices? Yes. I, okay. <laughs> All right. I, I'm, seeing my, I'm seeing my tax invoices. It's okay. It's an online payment. I can see that. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of people are going to see it. What's my name? My name's Roger. Roger? <laughs> okay. Uh, can, yeah. I, can I find you on YouTube? Can I find you on YouTube? I don't know. Can I find you? Uh, yes, you can. <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously, right? I mean, oh, you'll, maybe eventually you'll find out, right? Uh, I don't know. I uh, see. I once talked to Jim. Uh, uh, it was yeah. a long time ago, two years maybe. I, I talked to him and uh, I offered him help, but at that time he he wanted uh, me to bug on 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 uh, people, and I was not supposed to do that. You never bug on anyone here because yeah, because you, 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 you scammers got to stick together, right? <laughs> the pieces of shit got to no, stick together. No, no. If if you if you bug on someone, you get killed. <laughs> That's nah. the here. Okay, so I don't want. So, to so you like being a scammer? Yeah. You like being a scumbag? No man. It sounds like you like it. It sounds like you really like it. You sound like you're enthusiastic about it. You like waking up in the morning and realizing you're a scumbag. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm optimistic about life. I got the bank balance in my, in my account, and uh, you know I can just go onto the hills and uh, and look. I'm enjoying my life. I do that. But uh, if, if you tell me why would I think about uh, society and shit, ask, ask, ask Elon Musk. <laughs> ask Elon ask, Musk? Yeah, I'm sure he has a lot of experience with scamming people in a call Bates. center. Of course, of course. Uh, oh, no, 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 what I'm saying, man. I'm saying this. Ask these people why did they scam well, the whole world. He scammed COVID. you? Yeah. Why? Why do you keep going back to this COVID thing? We're talking about you sitting at a little crappy Pentium computer scamming people. And uh, still, I'm making more money than you. Anyway, uh, did you? How wear much a mask are you making? In the pandemic. In the pandemic, did you wear how, a mask? How much are you making? Did you wear a mask in the pandemic? Well, answer my question. I'll tell you. How much are you making? Answer my question, asshole. Do you make? Do, do you wear uh, a mask in the pandemic? You don't have the room to talk here, Ben Chode. Uh, and you don't even have the decency to set my dick. Anyway, the uh, details are on the screen, Scammer. <laughs> it's funny how defensive okay. you guys get when you get caught. Uh, no, uh, nobody can be uh, like me because uh, nobody like you you're the that. you're the best scammer in that call center, huh? You're the big top scammer. Uh, no, I'm the one who fucked your mother and got your uh, ah, Bencho. Come on, you already know I was with your mom last night. You want to hear? I know she's dead, so if you want to... Oh, I got it right her, here. Yeah. <laughs> Look, that's the sound of your mother. You got my dead mama over there? Come on. Oh, gosh, now she's dead? <laughs> she was uh, dead when I was 10. It doesn't concern you, motherfucker, so don't get it. It does concern me. Uh, why? Because uh, you're a scammer. Why is that? Uh, why does it concern you that I'm a scammer? What do you mean, why? You're scamming people over here, why? so it concerns me. Why? You think you're do you, do you feel, do you feel uh, good? What are you doing? You're just your do you time. feel good knowing that... <laughs> you're just wasting your time. That's He's mad. Do. do something. You, you do this. You, you, make, you make a documentary out of this video. You put it on YouTube. <laughs> maybe you'll make some money. Or you can do this. You uh. can put it all on Patreon as well. And in Patreon, you can... On Patreon? Who yeah, do you think I, I am? I uh, you could be uh, Tom Dick Harry, it doesn't concern me. So, go fuck your stuff. <laughs> all you well, I'm putting all the mind. documentation online anyway, so. <laughs> what is the, come on, tell me, what is the website? Huh? I want to know. Is scammers, know scammers get scammed. <laughs> I'm sorry? What, what the, the is, is, okay, the website's thebigbencho.com. 
Okay, and that features you? Come on. Yeah, type the, <laughs> the big benchode.com. Type it. That's, the big benchode.com. Okay, that, 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 that features you, right? No, that features you. You're the big bencho. <laughs> the big bencho dot com, right? Now you're just being. Uh, now you're just doing the uh, do game that we used to do. And you're just a kid. What's your age, man? What's your age? Uh, me? Yeah. You don't know. Uh, my father. You need. You need to know. Oh, that you're my father. father. Yeah. No, that can't be right. That's why you're wasting so much of the time finding me, right? Because wasting I my time. I got away with I'm wasting it. your now time you right are... now, Ben Chod. <laughs> okay, do you think that, like, uh, while I'm speaking to you, uh, people are stopped here? They're not scamming people? Come on. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, I can I'm hear them. Your time so that you can be yeah. engaged with me and we can scam people. Yeah. So how much, <laughs> how much per gigabyte do you pay on that internet bill? Uh, just, just the amount that your mama takes to uh, let her pussy be wet on my fingers. <laughs> Man, you scammers <laughs> always get sexual, huh? Of let course, it, let that's it. the only way to offend you. Come on. Where, where's the big? I want to talk to the owner. Where's the owner? Okay, you want to talk to the owner? Yeah, I haven't talked talk to a scammer to owner, owner in a while. You're not the owner. You sit at the computer with the other guy, and then you put the call on mute and say that it's on hold. Oh, you've been transferred, huh? <laughs> so, now you get it? Now I get what? It, 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 you know, I understand. You're an American, so uh, you, you're you supposed to be slow. <laughs> supposed to be that. Yes, I'm supposed to be slow. That's why your job is scamming people, because you can't make a proper living. <laughs> no, I and I'm supposed to be living. slow. You know, it's, it's, sometimes it's, it makes me sad that you guys can't get yeah. the mind to go out and get an actual job and make an actual career. Maybe that's why so many people in your country are ashamed of you and the reputation that you've put on your country. He's talking to another scammer now. Yep, I, I direct them how to do it, how to know how to perform the actions. Oh, yeah, Android or iPhone, yeah, that's really, that's so complicated. Yes, people are so dumb here, even dumber than you guys, so. Um, well, you're scammers, so I figure you're one of them. <laughs> yeah, uh, I figured that you guys took a lot of time to uh, figure out that we're scamming you, you know. We take a lot of time years. to figure out that we're scamming you. That's, that's an amazing uh, that's sentence. It's it's almost 37 years that we have been fucking you guys. So 37 years. Wow, 37 years and you're still doing it? No, Doesn't no, no. seem that profitable. It's 27. It's 27 Oh, 27 years. years. Yeah. So it's you're just going to you're, you're going to be an old man you. with your grandchildren. You're going to be like, "Oh yeah, what did you do? Oh, I scanned people. I was a piece of crap." That's a good way to teach some morals. It's okay. You don't worry about my grandchildren. When your grandchildren will uh uh, will fuck your uh, own daughter, then it will be very, uh, you know, complicated because uh, ben the mama culture, the milk culture, the grill culture is very popular in their country. Kutia, right? why, why are you so mad? You think I'm mad? Yes, you're mad. You're mad. You, you're not, you weren't able to scam me, and now I'm coming at you with your own information. You realize you're too so dumb, and you've gotten got. You're, you're just a big bench show. You're trying, to, you're trying to act like I'm getting intimidated by you, but it's not. And you're getting so yeah. upset by that. I understand that. Oh, I'm, okay. I'm. Trust me, I'm it's so upset. Out of the thousands of scammers I call every week, you've made me so upset. Okay, so that that figures that you are uh, a scam baiter. <laughs> What's your name, man? A scam baiter. What's My name's name? Roger. Can I find you on YouTube? I I want. You I want find, to I'll, I'll show you here. I'll on. show you. I'm actually I'm actually in the call center with you. Okay, You're actually in the call center. Uh, what, yeah. what kind of uh, what kind of clothes I'm, are you I'm, wearing? I'm there are thousands of people here. Oh yeah, there, there's thousands of people there. Okay, yeah, I'm three cubes down. Three cubes down. Yeah. Hey, no, that's that's Abby Shake. That, that that's not you. Come on. Look, that's look, look. I'm I'm right here. I'm in this one. I'm in this one right here. Three, with all You're these thousands one? of people, with all these thousands of people, I'm, I'm on this desk right here. Oh, the thousands of people, where are they? Yes, the thousands mind? of people right You're here. You're being 
Thank you. It you just you just said there were thousands of people here, so I'm just showing you like obviously you can fit a thousand people in this room, right? <laughs> That's just one room. You, you dumbass, come on. Well, let's go to the other room then. Let's go down here. Okay, I'm in this one right here. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I, I forgot that we only have two rooms. I came oh in through God. I came in through this box. Oh you see that God. box? That's where I I'm came really in sorry. from. I forgot we only have two rooms. We only have two closets. Oh, Obviously, That's yes. Bad. We have two rooms. That's bad. Come on. That is bad. We're so poor. So, We're dirt poor. This is not the part, not the center. Oh, you we must be if you have to resort to scamming people. This is a, this is an interesting building y'all got here, though. You got Halloween yep. decorations. It looks like going on here. What is this? This is probably what it looks like right now, huh? Since it's what one eighteen a.m. No, that, that, that's not the one. That's not the one. The other one. Wait, wait. I'll show you. Wait. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Well, it's nighttime there. This, this is the this one. This is daytime, uh, that, though. Yeah, daytime, but uh, this is the one that we're in, and uh, the building looks like this. Uh, yeah, from inside. This one. Okay. And so it's this one, yeah. and then here's someone else, then here's someone else. Oh uh, yeah. Wait. wait so why? I'm so why did y'all incorporate a scamming call center? Uh, it's good money. It's good money. What's S R S S R mean? Uh, that's, that doesn't even mean anything. Right, so what, are you one of these guys then? Since you, you said you're a top dog. Are you Sanita? How do you say that? Sanita Lama or Rupesh Grunge? Hello? Uh, hello? I'm sorry, I couldn't get that. Say that again. Yeah, how do you say these names? I'm not sure how to pronounce them right. Sanita? Su Sunita? Lama, Rupesh, Garunj, Garanj. I'm not sure how to pronounce that right. A million authorized capital, paid up capital, two hundred thousand. Yeah, that's pretty good. Non-government company, private. Looks like you guys incorporated in 2019. Yep. Yeah. So the company's been going good. But how how do you pronounce these names? I'm not sure how to pronounce these. Oh, and here's the your it's guys' okay. email address. Oh, yeah. Oh, so you're on the fourth floor. So you only have one floor. Well, yeah, at least that's what your incorporation says. It says you're on the fourth floor, module F, phase one. Webel IT Park. I'm not sure how to pronounce this. Nagar PO. Why is your phone going so crazy, man? What happened? What happened? I'm lo I'm looking at. Uh, uh, how do you pronounce? Is this Sanuta or Rupesh? Mm-hmm. It's a new one. You're Sanuta. Mm-hmm. Oh, so you're you're one of the you're one of the directors. I thought. Well, the yeah. last guy said you had thousands of employees, so I was just wondering why it says you're only on the fourth floor in Module F Phase One. I'm so I'm just curious why. It, why it says that you don't own the whole building on your company's actual information, you know? And what what does RSSSR Private Limited even mean? <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> oh, that got him scared, and now he's blocking my number. Let's listen in. So here's the call center. Let's see. Can I send him a text? Well, he, oh no, he's blocked me, huh? Let's let's see if I can call back on a different number. Um, <laughs> let's see if uh, he'll pick up. They're not picking up on a different number. He's just watching it. He hasn't picked it up. Let's try again. 
He, he's uh, he's just closing it and not uh, picking up my calls now. And he's blocked my other number. Yeah. So now he's just blocking my numbers as they come in. Let's see. Um, yeah. So as you can see here, here's all his company's information right now. You could hear the call center in the background. He's just sitting there looking at the computer. <laughs> Probably just scared out of his pants on uh, what's going on here <laughs> so <laughs> yeah they, he was real he was real confident there for a minute until I uh, told him hey uh, here's your uh, your stuff <laughs> you know so yeah he's not picking up my phone calls or nothing now uh, he just keeps blocking me every single try I try to get in contact with these guys again on even on new numbers I've called them on new numbers and stuff and they just block it every single time. Um, and I can't even get an actual conversation with these guys. So I'm going to end this video here. But we got them. Here's their freaking their location. Um, you can look up their company if we go back here. Um, but if we look up their company here. R R S. Uh, oh, actually, I have it right here. R-R-S-S. Private Limited. Um, it's an actual little company here and where they're scamming people and you could see the location the company's information and all of that and you could see who owns it Sanuta and Rupesh and it looks like he got pretty freaking uh, actually scared when I said that yeah he was pretty uh, yeah he wanted to say everything be like yeah I don't care I'm not scared and uh, I don't care what you say and all that and then by the time I uh, actually went out and I said hey this is uh this is what's happening this is your location yeah it actually scared him <laughs>